Welcome to Foundation Armor. Thanks for joining us. So today, I want to talk about the difference between water-based and solvent-based acrylic sealers. Let's get into it. All right, so acrylic sealers are available in both water-based and solvent-based formulas. And one type of acrylic sealer isn't necessarily better than the other, but there are several differences between them that will impact the look, the life, application, and maintenance. And which type of acrylic sealer is best for you? Well, it really depends on your preferences and the application environment. Let's first talk about the look. So solvent-based acrylic sealers will darken the surface of the concrete to make it look wet while water-based acrylic sealers will provide little to no change in the color of the concrete. So if you like what your concrete looks like when it's wet and you want a color enhancement, a, a solvent-based acrylic sealer is the best option for you. However, if you like what your concrete looks like right now and want little to no color enhancement, a water-based acrylic sealer is the best option then. Now that we understand the look, let's talk about odor. Solvent-based acrylic sealers have an odor during application until they're fully cured, while water-based acrylic sealers have little to no odor. If you are sensitive to odors or live in an area where odors will bother your neighbors, a water-based acrylic sealer is your best option. Okay, so let's talk about repair. Solvent-based acrylic sealers can easily be repaired with xylene or the Armor Blush Repair, but water-based acrylic sealers, they can't. If issues arise during application or afterwards, water-based acrylic sealers need to be removed and then reapplied. Okay, so a very important topic is maintenance. If issues arise during the life of a solvent-based acrylic sealer, such as bubbling or hazing, solvent-based acrylic sealers can be repaired with xylene or armor blush repair. If issues arise during the life of a water-based acrylic sealer, however, the water-based acrylic sealer can't be repaired and will need to be removed and reapplied. All right, so let's talk about reapplication. When it comes time to reapply a solvent-based acrylic sealer, you simply put a fresh coat onto a clean and dry surface. That's it. When it comes time to reapply a water-based acrylic sealer, there are three likely scenarios. Reapplication of water-based acrylic on a surface that's degraded to the point where you can no longer see any sealer, simply apply two new coats of the sealer. Now for smooth flat surfaces, you may be required to screen sand the surface before applying a new coat of water-based acrylic. If the water-based acrylic sealer is failing or delaminating, it's suggested to remove the old sealer before applying. Now, if you were looking for a water-based acrylic sealer, what you wanna do is consider the Armor WB-15 or Armor WB-25. Now, if you're looking for a solvent-based acrylic sealer, we would recommend the Armor AR350, Armor AR500, or Armor AX25. And as always, if you ever need help with choosing the best acrylic sealer for your application, don't ever hesitate to reach out to a Foundation Armor technician. They'd be glad to assist you. Well, we hope this video was helpful for understanding more about acrylic sealers. As always, thank you so much for tuning in, and don't forget to visit www.foundationarmor.com for more great videos and to purchase professional-grade concrete sealers and coatings. I look forward to seeing you soon.